On Wednesday night, Mark Halperin, senior political analyst at MSNBC, best-selling author and editor at Time magazine, gave a presentation in the Class of 1950 Lecture Hall. Before the presentation began, the audience participated in various polls. Then, Halpern gave his presentation. I think Smart would be bet on Mitt Romney versus the rest of the field. He's not a perfect candidate by any means. Uh, he's not a perfect candidate for these times, necessarily. He's certainly not a perfect candidate for what the Republican Party is looking for in a nominee. And yet, he's the most likely nominee by far. Everyone who's won the nomination of either party during my career has had at some point during their campaign for the nomination uh, an existential mortal scare that doesn't they lose. Uh, George Bush, uh, George W. Bush lost in the Hampshire primary to John McCain. John McCain almost had to drop out of the race in 2008 he became the nominee. John Kerry had to mortgage his house in order to become the nominee in 2004. Barack Obama lost in the Hampshire primary to Hillary Clinton. You always have some sort of scare. Mick Romney has not had a scare like that at all. Uh, he's, he's moved along pretty smoothly, and it's hard to imagine that the only person, or the person who's the weakest uh, uh, front runner that either party's had in a long time is going to be the guy who defies that rule. After his presentation was complete, Halpern took questions from the audience, including one regarding Indiana Governor Mitch Daniels' chances at a presidency had he ran. I think Mitch Daniels would have been formidable. I think, uh, I think if you take the group of people who didn't run, they're more formidable than the people who are in this race, um, including Governor Daniels. Uh, the White House is pretty concerned about it. The fact that he was President Bush's budget director is certainly not the greatest thing to have on your resume at this point in our history. But there's no perfect candidates out there. And I think um, what, what um, worries the White House most is the message that Mitt Romney has right now when he talks about the president, which is something like this. The president's a nice man. He's a nice family. He's tried really hard, but he doesn't know what he's doing. He's in over his head. He's failed. Governor Daniels would have been a pretty good position to deliver a similar message with, by most standards, a more successful uh, and certainly more recent record as, as a governor. I watch Morning Joe, and I've always enjoyed watching Mark on the program. So when I saw that he was going to be here, I thought this was a great chance to come. I was interested in his viewpoints on the Republican candidates. He kind of echoes some of my feelings about them. and. Um, also interested in his viewpoints on Romney's record. So some of the things that I'd heard were kind of confirmed from his point of view. Afterwards, Halpern came to the Exponent Newsroom for a session with staff.